Hey guys, Mark back here again. Today I'm going to go over my uh, everyday carry bag slash get home bag. Um, first off, we'll start with the bag. What it is is the 511 Rush Moab. It's a sling back bag. Uh, one strap. It can go to either side. The other side just tucks in here if you want to switch it to that side. Um, but pretty cool little bag. We'll go over the stuff that I have in the bag and really quickly uh, if you have any questions please ask in the comments and I'll try and answer them. We'll go ahead and start with the back side here. There's a little pouch up here at the top and in that obviously I have a Patriot Alliance patch. I've just got a Gerber multi-tool. This is an older multi-tool. I'm not sure what which one it is. Uh, I got this from a friend years ago. Um, but nice little multi-tool. Uh, I carry that with me. I always got to have a multi-tool. And it just fits nice in that pocket. It's This is more of a communication style pocket, but I like to keep that there and accessible if I need it. So. Uh, obviously on the back side, we've got a uh, water or a hydration bladder compartment. I have a hydration bladder shoved in there uh, in case I need to fill it. It's available for me. Got the hose stuck down in there and everything. So just in case I need it, it's there. And I can switch it to another bag if need to. Alright, let's flip back over to the other side. Obviously, patch field. Um, and then, go ahead and open it up to this. Um, first thing I've got is I caught a cold recently, so I've got some emergency going on. Go ahead and open this all the way up. Always carry a toothbrush with me. You never know when you need to brush your teeth and things like that. So, we've got uh, extra keys, uh, bottle opener. Uh, a handcuff key. Uh, I work in corrections so I always have handcuff keys around. Um, just a bunch of extra keys all on a carabiner. Um, big paper clip I keep around just because it's a large piece of wire in case I ever need it. <laughs> a Swiss Army knife with my name on it. It was a gift. Um, I just kind of threw it in here. It's got tools on it. The blade kind of sucks but it works. Small little uh, surefire light. Needs a new battery right now. Uh, charger for my phone, always got to keep that. Uh, Sharpie, a little stylus, ink pen, um, some dental floss things, toenail clippers, a lighter, and I believe more chapstick. Yep, chapstick. Alright. And then in this pouch, I got Kleenexes, and that seems to be it there. In this one, I have more dentist or flossing tools and oh, some uh, cliff bars. Always got to have some energy if in case you need to high comb or something like that. Some more Kleenexes. Oh, no, that's the wrong pocket. Yep, that's it down in there. The Kleenexes were in this pocket. So, cliff bars in case I need some energy. They're shoved down in there. Always got to keep the teeth clean. Now, in the front, in these two pockets, I always keep some contact solution. I wear contacts on a daily basis. A monocle, in case I need to see something. A backup light, which I have a 511 pocket knife on there. It's just a backup, little cheap own pocket knife. In case my knife breaks or something, that way I have something to go with me in a pocket clip. Surefire light, old school Surefire. Keep the tail cap twisted so it doesn't go on. There it goes. But I keep that twisted off because you don't want to let it go on while you're in your bag. So that's what I keep in there uh, just so I have extras of everything that I carry with me on a regular basis. Brush back in. Yeah, it's pink. It was an extra. I don't really care whether what color it is. It's not my concern. Emergency can go back in. Alright. There it is. 
Okay, the next part of this bag that most people may or may not know is there's a hidden compartment right here behind this. Uh, there's a little tab here, you just rip it open, it's Velcro. In here, I keep backup magazines for my Glock 23, um, and it'll also fit in my Glock 27. Uh, just backup magazines to go down in there. I usually have my firearm on me, so I don't put my firearm in that compartment, which is what that is, what is, that, what that is designed for. All right, so the main compartment, you have little clips on each side. Take those off. The thing I like about this bag is it opens all the way up and lays all the way out just like that. And we'll go ahead and start with the main compartment first. Always in my bags I keep uh, an extra holster, a backup holster. Um, I have a concealed carry holster that I have on me in Alien Gear every day. But I always keep a Serpa holster or a backup holster, usually the Serpa um, paddle holster, in case um, I need it. I mean, if I go to the range impromptu, you know, go buy some ammo, go straight to the range, that way I have a holster to, to use out there or whatever. I mean, I always just keep an extra holster because you never know when something's going to break. So, And then I always keep a t-shirt with me. Um, like I said, I work in corrections, so... Um, I don't like to wear my uniform out to stores in case I leave work. So I always just keep a t-shirt to throw on instead of my uniform shirt um, when I leave the leave work. A pair of impact gloves, camouflage. Obviously these haven't been used very much because I just got them. So uh, small bit of paracord. Always got to have some paracord with me. I use this crap all the time. So. I have some zip ties. You never know when you're going to need zip ties. Alright, in this main compartment of this little cart here, I have an additional backup holster. This is a leather. I've had this for years. This is a Bianchi. Yeah. Always keep that in there. Backup pair of glasses. This is a Iraq Veteran 8888 Survival 10 I got from one of their man cans. I'm not going to open it up because it's taped shut. I have a video showing all the contents of this with the Iraq Veteran 88. 88 man can opening video. I have a Mara knife. Um, I'm trying to remember which one this is, but um, nice Mara stainless steel knife. I like to keep that with me. Nice sharp blade. Can't go wrong with Mara. A bandana. Always gotta have a bandana. And then just a camouflage beanie for when it's cold. And last but not least, a little roll of duct tape. So, always gotta have duct tape. Shove all that stuff back down in there. If I don't get all this stuff back in, then I won't have it. <laughs> There's two compartments, one on each side. The Velcro is open. Uh, in here, I just have a little flash drive that I keep with me. A uh, set of earplugs for when, if I go to the range. That's it on that side. Open the other side. We have a solar charger with cable. Um, and I keep my, uh, my phone charger in there. Um, you can charge this with um, a computer or whatever with this cable or it'll charge with the sun. It needs charged. It's not very charged right now. So I'll shut that back off. It does have a light on it when it needs charged or when it's charged. But I keep that with me. I also have a small little boo-boo kit. Um, little pills and whatnot in there. So I believe that's it in there. Go ahead and shove that stuff back in here. there for me when I need it. Alright, the top side, we'll go on this side first. Uh, I have a small little uh, cheap, it's a rat style tourniquet. It's not an actual rat's tourniquet, but it is the same style, it's generic version. Uh, seems to work pretty good. Uh, I did a video on these. Uh, I bought these from Wish.com. 
um, they're on there. You can see how it works. And that's it on that side. So I got the target with me in case I need it. And on the other side, I've got a little medicine pouch basically. Uh, all kinds of things in here. I got Tylenol, Advil, um, allergy medicines, uh, some latex and um, gloves, some medical tape. This is a little tooth repair kit. If you lose a tooth or something happens to your tooth, you are going to hate yourself. It's good to have one of those with you. Um, some mole skin and some super glue and some other medicines, you know, diuretics and things like that, um, just in case you need them. I always keep that with me. That's nice stuff. The last pocket, there's, it goes either side, it goes all the way through. Um, I keep a, this is like a 50 gallon trash bag, huge, big, mill trash bag. <coughs> and then an emergency poncho. And then last but not least, a survival blanket. Uh, in case you get trapped out in the woods, I always gotta have a survival blanket. So that's my EDC bag. That's what I carry with me on a daily basis. This bag goes with me out the door, goes in my truck, um, or the minivan, whatever I'm driving, usually I'm in the truck. Um, but it's with me every day when I get in. It's always in my truck and goes with me everywhere. If you have any questions on this bag or about what I carry, uh, feel free to ask them in the comments below. Like, share, subscribe. And we're gonna do another video here shortly. Thanks.